and in. Five, four, three. This is Dr. Rodney McKay speaking to you from my base of operations in the lost city of Atlantis, located deep within the Pegasus Galaxy. I record this message on the eve of our darkest hour. As I speak, an alien armada of biblical proportions is on its way, bent, dare I say, hell bent, in keeping with the metaphor, on our destruction. We will do our best to save off their attack, but I'm afraid the defeat is all but inevitable. I, and the other members of my team, face the most horrific deaths imaginable, as our, our, our very lives are, are sucked from our chests in a, in a, in a, a, a horrific... Okay, uh, okay, uh, start again, start again, or just, uh, cut that, right? <clears throat> My friends, I am Dr. Rodney McKay of the Atlantis Expedition, and to add the facts of our heroic struggle against the Wraith and our untimely demise are already known to you in, in that light, I'd like to pass along some final thoughts. Now, my extensive education, training, and first-hand experience in the field of astrophysics have given me a unique perspective that you on Earth or well, any other planet, for that matter, can match. I'd like to take a few moments now to uh, pass along that perspective to you. I'll begin with uh, a few observations on a, a subject that is both near and dear to my heart. Leadership. Never cared for dogs. Too much work, too needy, too unpredictable. I mean, you leave one door open, the tiniest little cracks in their dog. You look for them, you put up flies, it's no use. And since your father refused to pay for a license, the animal shelter has no way of tracking them. You know, God knows what happened to that little guy. Now cats, no, that's a whole thing. See, the cats are self-sufficient, they're dependable, you take the parts, they come running, send it for safe food. My cat, I truly believe he enjoys it. There's something very comforting about coming home from work at the end of the day and seeing a, a familiar face waiting for you, you know? Duh. I digress. Where was I? Uh, right. Leadership. That's another set I'll die with that I haven't seen. See, to be fair, when you traveled as much as I traveled, you think that missing Niagara Falls would be no big deal, but you know what? It gnaws at you. A lot of movies I wish I'd seen won't see now. It's a never saw Greece, even though I think for Olivia and John when I was a kid. I always wanted to see Gandhi. I only saw the first half of the Sixth Sense. I always wanted to have that ended. My sister. Um, Ford, if you just cut everything else. Keep this one, okay? Jenny? It's your brother. Rodney? Obviously. I, I want to say, um, I want to, I want to say something, uh, family is important. I, I, I've come to realize that because people here have become sort of, sort of family to me. Now, I know what you're thinking, I've never really been the push child for that kind of sentiment, but when... When one's contemplating one's undermines, one tends to see things more clear. I really do wish you the best, you know. I'm sorry to this. Perhaps, um, if by any chance I make it out of this alive, perhaps maybe we can be. I don't like it. Now, if there's time, I'd like to get back to the subject of leadership.